हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू फाइनेंशियल मैथमेटिक्स पार्ट थ्री टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस हाउ टू कैलकुलेट फ्यूचर वैल्यू फैक्टर एंड द फ्यूचर वैल्यू एनोडी फैक्टर मैं टॉक अबाउट फ्यूचर वैल्यू फैक्टर इट इज सेम एज फ्यूचर वैल्यू इंटरेस्ट फैक्टर हेयर वी वॉन्ट टू फाइंड आउट इफ वी इन्वेस्ट वन रुपी टूडे हाउ मच अमाउंट वी विल गेट एट द एंड ऑफ टेन ईयर्स द इंटरेस्ट रेट इज टेन परसेंट so for calculating this factor we use function equal fv when we say fv the first is rate of interest here the rate of interest is 10% number of periods are 10 there is no pmt and the present value because when we say when we are investing something so it's a outflow we say it is minus 1 rupee right we are not using any type because type we use when we talk about pmt so close this bracket and enter the answer is 2.594 what do you mean by that if we invest 1 rupee right now we will get 2.594 rupees at the end of 10 years at the rate of interest 10% next is future value annuity factor and it's also known as future value interest annuity factor we say if we are going to invest 1 rupee at the end of every year for 10 years at a rate of interest in percent how much amount will get that again we use same function equal fv in fv function first is the rate of interest next is number of periods are 10 here pmt again we are investing 1 rupee at the end of every year is outflow we say it is minus 1 rupee there is no present value and because we are investing at the end of the period so we are using zero here and end the answer is 15.97 what do you mean by that if we are going to invest 1 rupee at the end of every year For 10 years, a rate of interest 10 percent, we will get 15.97 rupees after 10 years. If we change that, if we say if we want rate of interest around 12 percent, and the years are five, years are five, and again, if we invest one rupee right now, a rate of interest 12 percent. For five years, we will get in future one point seven six two. This is the future value factor at the rate of twelve percent for five years. And if we are going to invest one rupee at the end of every year for five years at a rate of interest twelve percent, so we will get six point three five three rupees at the end of five years. Hope it is helpful. Thank you.